we are watching a system that is going to bring a tremendous amount of rain to the state. Now, it's not here yet. We're seeing a few clouds in southeastern Iowa floating in from that uh, what's left of the tropical storm. And until it arrives, you got a lot of heat to deal with. It's 89 degrees southeast wind 17 feels like temperature 91 here in the metro feels like 96 Spencer heat index and Sioux City 94 hot evening. So take it easy if you're walking the dog or walking yourself. Temperatures in the 80s out there through 8 p.m. There's a little bit of a southeast breeze and that's helping a bit. And again, those clouds slowly increasing. Uh, this is the remnants of that tropical system. It's marching up through Arkansas right now and you can see the edge of these clouds. These are actually the clouds moving in already to southeastern Iowa. So clouds on the increase tonight. The potential for some very heavy rainfall just west of I-35 and areas east as we head from tomorrow into Wednesday morning. Uh, a flash flood watch has been issued and this is going to be a lot of rain there. A wind advisory in northwestern Iowa overnight to, uh, to 7 p.m. because of strong winds. Here comes that moisture spreading in. Rain will start southern Iowa around 7 a.m. Metro, the heaviest rain may not arrive until late morning, early afternoon, but this system spins up with a lot of rain, moves out, and then there's another system moving in from the west. Watch this one move in Wednesday morning. It looks like it'll go southwest northeast across the state. Unfortunately, it will bring some more rain on already saturated ground. And finally, that pulls out with some big wind on Wednesday. So rain tracker, look at this rain, very heavy. And then that secondary area moving on through, you can look at this and you'll see there'll be pockets of lighter rainfall amounts, but there'll also be pockets of some very heavy rainfall across the metro. I think anywhere from two to maybe as much as four inches, depending on that second system rotating on through. So uh, check the sump pump. Uh, get yourself ready for some heavy rain. 71 degrees, hot early on, though it'll take a while to cool down to those 70s. Tomorrow, thunderstorms likely the heaviest rainfall in the afternoon and evening. High temperature at 75 degrees. Breaking things down hour by hour again. Rain chances increase morning, afternoon, and then it should taper off briefly before that secondary round arrives on Wednesday. So town to town, it looks like thunderstorms tomorrow in Ames. Could be some heavy rainfall in Indianola. The rain chances are earlier over in Mount Air, and look where you don't see a whole lot of rain, some 80s out west, 81 Denison. Scattered thunderstorms, Fort Dodge. Rain will move into Marshalltown and Toledo. Again, it'll arrive in uh, Centerville and Bloomfield early on with heavy rain possible and some scattered thunderstorms. Eight day forecast. Again, that next system on Wednesday. The good news is, and we will need it to dry out. It's a stretch of dry weather after that. 80s Thursday, Friday, sunshine, cooler for the weekend. And then we bounce back to those 80s next week.